Welcome back to another episode of the Hermit Poetry series. I'm Neil Aiken, and on this channel I read poetry, mostly work by contemporary poets, occasionally poems of my own, and once in a while poems from the past. Today's poem comes to us from Ada Limon uh, from Bright Dead Things, published by Milkweed in 2015. This poem is entitled Adaptation. It was, for a time, a loud, twittering flight of psychedelic-colored canaries, a cloud of startle and get-out in the ornamental irons of the ribcage, nights when the moon was wide, like the great eye of a universal beast coming close for a kill. It was a cave of bitten bones and snakeskins, eggshell dust and charred scraps of a frozen-over flame, all the things it has been, kitchen knife, and the ancient carp's frown, cavern of rust and worms and the airless tire swing, cactus barb, cut down tree, dead cat in the plastic crate. Still, how the great middle ticker marched on, and from all its four chambers to all its forgiveness, unlocked the sternum's door, reversed and reshaped, until it was a new, bright, carnal species, more accustomed to grief and ecstatic at the sight of you. Uh, that was Adaptation by Ada Limon from Bright Dead Things, published by Milkweed in 2015. Um, if you enjoyed this reading and this poem, please do check out the description of the video for more information about Ada Limon as well as a link back to the publisher site where you can purchase the book. Um, as a note, Ada Limon is the U.S. Poet Laureate, um, just announced as the new U.S. Poet Laureate. So uh, much congratulations to her and excited to be able to celebrate her and to um, uh, acquaint more people with her work. So um, perhaps we'll be back and reading more of her work in uh, the next few, well, in upcoming <coughs> Sorry, in upcoming episodes. Um, I'm grateful for each of you and for all your support. Grateful for those of you who like these videos, those of you who subscribe to the channel, and those of you who share these videos as links on social media. All this helps spread the good word about poetry and introduce more people to a wider range of voices and experiences and a lot of different ways in which people engage and explore and expand the world of poetry. Uh, I'm hoping that uh, as you listen and as you engage in these videos and other forms of poetry, that it inspires you to write, to create, to imagine, and to extend yourself into the lives of others, um, to broaden your community, and to enrich the lives of those that are close to you, as well as to become involved in the lives of those that are strangers. Um, I think that's the wonderful thing about art, is that it allows us to gain some measure of understanding and appreciation and gratitude um, as we listen to each other and as we encounter each other and as we imagine with each other um, what the world might be or what exists beyond our imagination in something even more wild, more fantastic. Um, and the ways in which it brings us back to our history, to our roots, to who we are and where we came from and where we're going next. So uh, thank you for your participation in this series and your support. Uh, I'm back every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday. Stay tuned for more poetry, more readings. Um, you have suggestions, uh, people you'd like to recommend, books you'd like to recommend, poems you'd like to recommend. Just contact me and let me know, and I'll do my best to work it into the series. So thanks to you, and uh, thanks to <laughs> everyone else that's out there uh, doing the work of poetry. We'll be back again soon. I'm Neil Aiken. This is the Hermit Poetry Series. And until next time, stay safe and well. Keep reading, keep writing, keep being part of the good work of poetry, and we'll be back again soon. Thanks.